Hello and welcome back to another episode of Jagged Alliance 3. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing the blind playthrough of Mission Impossible difficulty with all of the lethality options enabled. So a couple of good news. Number one, we have the Savannah, including the good old Landsberg mine that um, gives us quite a bit and including this big fat mine for 6,000, so we're making bank, boys. We're making bank. Now the not so good news, it's just taken a while to get the second team up and running and to train enough mercenaries at the same time. So you can see we're almost done with the training here. These two are nearly done. Once they are done, we are going to move them to here and or to here i'm not a hundred percent sure May, maybe to here um, and then uh, we can separately train but this is not the right combination we, we need to move them here um, and basically reunite the second squad and we're going to do two different things we're going to train steroid uh, who still needs a little bit more dexterity in between five to ten points of dexterity and the one who is going to train him is likely going to be Flay because he has high dexterity and he has good marksmanship so those two become a team uh, and everybody else basically trains marksmanship and then and only then guys then we're ready also these guys shortly need to do a pit stop here and get a better MP because uh, Steroid, I think, still has the Famous. And whilst the Famous is cool, it unfortunately doesn't allow for run and gun oversight in my perspective because it uses 5.56 ammunition, which is already very rare in the game, and it really should have the run and gun perk. Good. Whilst all of this is going on in the background, our main team is going to take take out the out uh, the outposts. So this one here will die once this is down. Uh, I think once this is down, we're going to take this one out. I think this is the literal last. Uh, uh, last bit, so we're not going to take that. But yeah, these two outposts need to go. And I'm not sure if this here is another outpost. So let's go for those two outposts and just reduce the amount of enemy teams that are coming. <clears throat> good. Second team, good. Let them just rest so that they are okay. Oh, and we need to liberate that as well. Yep. Yeah. And let's let's do the outposts first. <clears throat> Too much to do on the the map. Very Good. Seems like a normal I don't village. Know what it is, but we should probably take it just in case we need it. Hello. Come with me, everyone. Oh, problem. Some stuff over there. Very under. Moving to. And I'm wondering as well, <clears throat> what's the maximum level for the mercenaries, and what's the best way of leveling with them? Serpent. So far, it seems that quests have been. Fast. As with lock and key. Have been the best way. So far, quests have been the best way. Uh, so, I would like to get the mercenaries further up. We're at level 7 at this point. Hey, 
But this team here also needs to put a couple of a uh, couple of items money. back into port cacao. He just wants to take money from my pocket and look good doing it. Not my president. If you ask me, the president is already dead. <laughs> Hashtag not my president. All right, all right. Little bit of a we'll US presidential Donald I Trump uh, type of reference. No problem. Let's go. We should probably check this out, right? Uh, someone built an effigy close to the Camp Xi'an. It may lure some Legion soldiers out. Hello. Okay, Are I see. Let's get them. Huh? Enemies. Well, that happened a bit too uh, too soon. Going to need help getting out of this. Pretty good odds, I think. Ready. And the beast is with us back there. Good free move. In my sight. Nice little overwatch. Dug the line. Let's pop this guy. That was so cool! I wish I could shoot like that. Mary Unger, I have no clear shot. Oh. I have good odds of hitting enemy. Oh, good. Hit order. Let's teach him a valuable lesson with a machete. Sure, we'll get there. Good, who's the beast? All right, all right. Sure, we'll get there. Disappeared as quickly as they came. We move with certainty. Heading out. Very interesting. Okay. Um, we're going, right? We will do. Very interesting. Okay. Hi. Let's move. So we can't get down there. I guess we're going. Which means we have seen the majority of all of this here, I suppose. The effigy has indeed lured out a couple of them. Maybe we have weakened the camp, who knows. We're moving? We're moving. You think you're rich? But you are nothing compared to old farmer bags. He owns all those middle of wherever farms, among other things. I'm sure he's very Okay, little reference for <clears throat> the middle of nowhere farms. Uh, we just took out, we just took out a bit of the defense, indeed. <clears throat> Camp Chien Sauvage. It's raining, and we have no intel. Which isn't good. So we typically want to have intel. Okay. Um, quietly, like this. Moving. Did I tell you I am great at hiding? I sneak up. Oh, there's a sniper up there. I see. Okay. I have spotted a thing that wants an investigate. I move in height. I'm not sure I recognize that species. Let me get my field guide. Fuck, I think Barry has been spotted out. Yeah, okay. Intruders! Alarm! Oh, 
Not the end of the world, uh, still sucks. Good, locking that down. They cannot hit what they cannot see. This dude won't hear me coming. He has a armored head. I am which not sure I can handle I this. Do not like. See me. Good, we got, got the angle to do this, this guy here. <clears throat> that little side hustle was damn smooth. Oh, come on. This is no problem. This enemy soldier is pinned down. Hello. Did I tell you I am great at hiding? Can't reach that. Oh, we can't get in here. I see how it is. How can I assist? Okay, well, interesting, isn't it? to here Explosive. it's this guy I will go presently Can we now move in? No. But I think now we can move in. There we go. See, Barry, uh, um, Sigur uh, finds his way. Good. Yes, go. Moving to here and getting a little bit of a drink. Back to Barry. He moves over here. Good visibility. The Lord forgives me. Okay, well, that was an interesting first turn, one that was very improvised.
Hogby definitely has uh, some nice area of control there. And lots and lots of hyenas. <laughs> Kill zone is great. Uh, Igor, you could have just opened the door. Upon you, brother. Oh, it hurts. It hurts. I swear you represent. Live wire here. Don't be ridiculous. Fine. Good. I let's see. Do this. That's what she said when she beheaded him. What? And the good part about that kill zone is we're actually doing two Overwatch uh, shots per salvo uh, now. Here. That is a really, really good ability. I do it. But take cover. Free move takes cover. How can I assist? I will do. And we're moving in. Uh, the camp is almost ours. Ready to um do stuff. MD overwatches and we're good. Oh wow, double overwatch. Look at that. I mean he moves in and wants to shoot and he gets he gets tagged four times wow hogbite is an absolute monster now i think we got enough anacondas at this point good weapon yes Good. Ice and hog bites. Need to move a bit. Yo, watch my back. Moving to position. And I think Lifeline can also Please move. We're leaving me. MD alone here. He hides. Hide what? 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 I don't think so. An alligator. Definitely spot me. Okay, well, that's Got the problem. It. I'll shoot at anyone I see. I mean, bad guys, of course. Just the bad guys. Okay, that's a bit too much. Uncle's down, takes cover. Alligator back and forth, back and forth. Yes. It's now in one on one with Igor. But Igor just kills the alligator. Ready. Target locked. Oh, 
up, player? Word up. Good, some healing. What's this is happening? Thanks. Doing hella good now. Okay, we have a lot of cool weapons. M16A2. Which sort of the commando seems to be the worst version, but way more crit version of the M16. Scrapping that, uh, we have a lot of M14s, that's fine. Scrap the pens. Yes. Very unga. Wow. More ammunition. Hello. At this we're point moving. we're pretty much we're moving. rolling a dough when it comes to Red action. Uh to I do it. Ammunition. Nice. Good sniper. You have order. Ready for action. Oh. Oh. We should take a closer look at this. More ammunition even. God damn it, look at that. You have order? Um we need to set, uh, set some time aside to create armor penetrating rounds for this group. You will see. Or you will not. <laughs> Quiet. Why in it smooth? This is always the best way to do things. What? Yo, who let the dogs out? Better to go unnoticed, yeah? There's a trained hyena back here. And I think it's the last one afterwards. All of the camp is clear. Like this? Hide and shoot. That is my game. Honestly, I don't understand the point of not hiding. Figured. Okay, cool. Word up. Hey, you're not with these animal torturers, are you? Please <laughs> better. That is funny. Uh, we wanted medium armor to be upgraded, but we also wanted deskward armor to be upgraded. Hmm, good question. We could really use more weave padding. Here's fully upgraded armor, that's good. I think we're just going to upgrade the Kevlar. Human person, but that's just impossible. Besides, it would be bad for their diet to eat me. I've already tried to offer them vegan food, but they laughed at me. I mean, not just the bad. Stuff. Thanks for letting me out. What, 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 what is this? Infected? Those poor hyenas must be terrified in that cell. Time to take the flower by the thorns. All right, Igor will take care of this. Uh, there's an eco-activist imprisoned uh, in the camp. I think we've found said eco-activist. So, Pedda. How can I assist? War is uncooperative. Uh, I wonder, what is your thing? 
with certain uh, you don't want to fight in the pit I understand that of course I make Uncle Yvonne proud with this shot Getting the party started over here! Keep it in real. Good. What was I expecting? Of course the hyena would attack us. You have order? Aye. We have agreement. Hold up. Check this out. We do it. Good, you could have just exploded this and let all of the hyenas out. And created some chaos. Hackable device here, hackable device there. And hackable device there. We out Heading out. Go. Let's go, yeah. Okay, I think we're pretty much okay. We have agreement. Sure. Oh. Good. I thought there might have been something in the pit, but apparently that's not the case. Sure, we'll get there. They got a crocodile, which is super cool. And they got a lot of hyenas, which is nice as well. But uh, all of that didn't help them in the end because we took over. Got some militia training that we could do here. Could do some... Some treating of wounds. Let's start with that. I'll get right on Hop by it. chills. Um, who is training the militia in the meantime? Igor and Barry. I have initiated work on this task. And Livewire begins to repair the items. Okay, from here, once we have put a bit more defense in, <clears throat> we should be able to get over here and kill that outpost. Uh, and we will need to kill that outpost. Good, these guys are okay. Uh, which tells me you can already start with a bit of training here. Because I think we've... Have we trained uh, the outpost? Yeah, the militia here is good. I wanted marksmanship. Yeah, funnily enough, the wrong people are there. But, you know, what we can also do? Hit point training. Oh, it's never wrong. I hope this task will be a good workout. Okay, the last uh, team here is done. We need that extra MP. Hogbite is no longer tired, which is good. Okay, put him in here. This task will not be a problem to me, and I will be honored to do it. Ice is cured off of all wounds, which means we really can change this around a bit. Bit of scouting because we want to get intel. All right, back in the camp here. I think we left a few uh, supplies. <clears throat> we had this pistol, the flare gun. 
which we wanted to take. Uh, did we want to take any heavy armor is the question. Potentially not right now, but I need a run and gun gun. And this here, uh, this um, here MP5 gives run and gun and has a medium range. Better than the normal MP5K, the short version. So I think we're just going to use the MP5. All of the other weapons do not have run and gun. Um, I think in the meantime we can also scratch a little bit of that. Salvage a bit of that. Okay, hmm. Yeah, I wanted to build the team different, specifically a bit more run and gun ish with submachine guns and revolvers. I think we're still going to take one of these anacondas with us because uh, they seem to be really good weapons. Okay, and anything else we want? Larry has all of the explosives, that's good. No, I think we're fine. Unless I'm missing something. I mean, we could go, uh, get another RPG. Uh... All things considered, that might not be a bad idea, because the team might run into problems. You know what? Let's leave that back, because we also have limited carrying capacity. And I want the team to really start, uh, get started, it feels like, for episodes at a time. I'm trying to get this started. Good. This squad to here. Good. We got all of uh, the items repaired. And of course, someone was severely malmed by animals. That happens always. I'll get right on it. Good. Plenty of stuff done here. Let's finish the scouting and the militia training. Can we still continue to scout? Yes, we can. On it like white on rice. Good. These two now need to just rest because they are incredibly exhausted. And you can see yet another legion attack squad that is coming all up to here. So we also need to destroy this one here, apparently. That sends attack squads as well. What was I expecting, right? 
but we would be ready for it. Uh, how about strength training? You guys good in strengths? No, you are not. But strengths isn't that important for them. Health is. I hope this task will be a good workout. Old diamond mine K10 is running dry. K10 is down here. Yeah, okay, but listen. We got two new mines. We're absolutely fine. No need to hurry. We're good. Good, we've scouted all of the area. That's cool. You're going to remove the wounds from yourself. Ice is continuing the training here. And Hogbite has more leadership, so let's do that. Barry is not finished with training. Igor definitely is finished with training as well. Uh, who does have good medical training? Um, 26, Igor. Igor has good medical training. And has really poor leadership, so Barry, you're all helping here. Let's go. And that should be... Quick. Good. And finally, our newly assembled team with all of the squads can start fighting. Let's put them in one squad together. Um, you guys are in the back line, you are in the mid line, you are in the front line, which is good. Let's do a bit of inventory management, shall we? Uh, that's hard for him. I don't like uh, the wording hard. Additional aim level, large uh, crit chance bonus with maximum aim level, or the prison scope. Moderate crit chance, silent attacks. Yeah, all of that is moderately difficult. I think we should go over and let Lifeline uh, do the modifications on the gun and just accept for now that he does have a gun. Good. Uh, we wanted... Yeah. We wanted uh, the flare gun, but no one can really carry the flare gun. In night, uh, during night ops, we would have a couple of flares with blood, so that must be good enough, which means this really goes into the stash here. 
We even got some night uh, goggles uh, for buns if needed. Okay, so that's cool. She's going to be the sniper, that's fine. Uh, Flay dual pistols at this point. Like the idea. Larry, Anaconda, and a shot. That's good. Uh, Mouse is moving up all the way so that at some point she can then use a shotgun. Uh, Blood is doing the same. He has Mabex's argument for that. Blood also would have flashbangs because he would be going in. And smoke grenades. I think we can put that into the stash here. I mean, steroid can use combat knives, but that would uh, prevent him from you uh, from using his uh, fist, his special ability. But maybe, since he has more dexterity now, that is no longer necessary. Maybe I give him uh, the anaconda with 20 range. Uh, that's just as good as his MP5. be good to give him a pistol kind of as an offhand maybe we'll just give him now yeah, we'll give him a proper weapon as an offhand there you go he just takes them 14 if needed good still haven't figured out the second weapon for steroid uh, if he runs and guns uh, we got a sharp machete for mouse, but um, and good dexterity, but she does not yet have the right strengths in order to make it work. That might change soon, though, so no worries. Good, a bit of that fake money can be placed here. A few of the pipes can be placed here. Very good. So this is his reserve weapon, that's cool. Blood does have a long ranged option in that case. I'm not sure if we need the combat knives for steroid. Uh, steroid really wants to just use his bare hands. So once we're in melee, it's kind of, he's just using his bare hands switches to them and then Hulk smashes them. That unfortunately wouldn't work because he needs both hands free, which I think is stupid. It would be so cool to give him something like a flare gun and then he at least can use his, uh, his bare hands. But yeah, that is the setup. Everybody has a med kit. Yep, everybody has a med kit, and I think we're good to go. Not modifying his weapon too much, and to be fair, for this encounter, let's just give him the famous. And he'll just shoot a bit more from range. Okay, cool. So, we're up. Two tired uh, mercenaries, but we want to see team number two fight in Chalet du Lapé. We're going to play this one very differently from our other uh, fight. Going to let them come down here and are going to greet them this is an open space. Yeah, we're positioning ourselves up here. Yes. I'm good at being overlooked. They won't see me until it's too late. 
Got steroids here. How they won't spot my magnificent physique. I'm so quiet, I can't even hear myself. Found a bad guy. This is how I approach the key. Observe. One sneaks up on the enemy like so. How do they see me? Enemy spotted! Enemy spotted! But we gotta take care of the gunner first. Good ambush position. Okay, well that was decent. Her passive gain accuracy bonus uh, against Man, targets that have been targeted this turn. This okay. Steroid, free moves. This will be fine. Takes this guy down and that looks super professional and everything. positions himself on the ground. The prey did not see. This is no good. It will spook outside of range. Oh, that sucks. I don't want to use too many uh, too many rifles. But in dire circumstances, it is allowed. Good. Larry here. Takes these guys out. Heads up, zombies! Ah, it hurts! It hurts! Um. This is full cover. I like it. Mobile move into here. And Larry. Oh, <laughs> hits him good. We put in some extra effort. Oh, just sleep here, but more blessing. Okay, Mouse is tired, which explains why she can't just run and gun freely. As always, she has problems hitting them. Those are pretty clean shots. I don't know why she's missing them. Severely wounded onto the torso. They have zero chance. Our manliness is overwhelming. Our manliness. That's my kind of woman. Uh, just double checking real quick. We do have the shotgun perk. Yeah. Okay. So. All right. Let's go. One. Miss. Throw a knife. But should could also just invalidate the argument. Moving. Moves back. This idea stinks worse than spoiled meat. And throws another knife. Almost. Okay, not bad for a first turn. Oh, oh, well, I retract my statement. Gosh, that is terrible. Holy shit. But we need to get in and out. That was not good.
He certainly needs a bit more grit. And, and more damage reduction. Or the dodge perk. That is that would be good, yeah. I think the dodge perk. Good, remove cover. Larry has good position here. Larry is a decent shot, I must say, and the Anaconda is stealing quite a bit of damage. Alright, hail of knives. You guys go ahead. I'll catch up. Ready when you are. Good. With the exception of blood almost dying, that was a pretty decent fight. Blood hey, needs more hey, hit man. points. Next time we in town. And another defense layer. What is up? What man? kind of what kind of armor did we give him? He had good armor. But he just took so many shots and that wasn't even an open uh, an open uh, part of his body. Hmm. Yeah, ma look, maybe a gas grenade for the next time. I don't know. If you go in close, you better kill the enemies right away. You don't just leave it in the open. Essentially, he moves in, hits them, and just moves out again. And yeah, since the shotgun is almost out, we give him an M16 for now. His shotgun shells are running low. <clears throat> we need to figure something out to deal with the Mabaxter's argument invalidator. I need a single shotgun shotgun. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I should be working out. All right, unload, scratch that. Follow me, or I'll just follow you. Nope, that's fine. Cool. Well, see, good, uh, good news is we have hospital treatment here. Um, High loyalty in the sector decreases the cost of the operation. Oh yeah, we're aborting this, thank you. Uh, 5,000, but okay, at least it does not cost any meds. Mouse and Larry, chill a bit, and play buns and steroids what can i teach you play and buns could require some hit points good not the best training but some i consider it that so these uh, three are training. In the meantime, the prime <coughs> prime group uh, trains uh, the other side. Um, that other camp. How far are we here at the moment? Uh, halfway through the training. Igor and MD are back. Which means we're going to put 
the Iceman in here. I'll get it done. Continuing the training. And what do we want to do here? A couple of hit points, nice, yeah, but not necessary. Everything else, every stat is pretty much fully filled. Strength is the only one where we could get a bit more inventory space. MD could teach Lee, uh, could teach some uh, marksmanship. Maybe not the worst idea. We could also uh, get explosive training or engineering. I think we're using one of uh, those. One more round of explosive training for everyone. I have initiated work on this task. Good. Um, now, blood is being uh, is being <coughs> repaired. We can finally split this team, <coughs> and we wanted a trainer for uh, steroids agility. <coughs> and Flay should have been the trainer, uh, not agility dexterity. That is. means this team force moves to here whilst this team finally can work on the marksmanship with the ones uh, that really 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 need it Good, whilst we're in the training process, put blood in and do that. <clears throat> and now the Alpha Squad can train in a different sector. And we want dexterity because steroid needs to hit. Good. One last fight and then we're pretty much at the end of today's episode. This one should be an easy uh, fight. Livewire here. Using Intel, I've managed to visualize the enemies on my PDA. Good. We know where the I enemies are. Ready. Enemy soldier. Looks like he is just doing his job at the moment. Doing. Still undetected. Huh? They found us. Okay. Enemy spotted. Let's see. Hogbot. Hits. Kills this guy. Hits. Kills that guy. I have multiple targets in sight. Ice here. Got a good shot on this mother. All right, Ice Man. Gets one down. Right in the grill. Watch me pop a cap in this dude. And gets the second dude down. Hello. Um, Michael here. Good chance of me, um, not missing. The Major will hear of this! I'm just gonna say it. I really think that was completely hot. I think I can do this. Good. Uh, we're with assist? Barry. I have no clear shot. May they reach salvation. 
Good, and finally, good old Igor teaches this guy a valuable lesson. <laughs> Prime team is so much better than the second one. It's not even a challenge against these uh, fools here. Of course. Very Have we forgotten to salvage Hello. parts here? No. On our way. Okay, Petta apparently wanted to of great value. help the animals. And yeah, well, that was a stupid idea, was it? I mean, I'm not against animal helping, but why would you go into the ring with them? An apple a day, a hog bite. I like to <coughs> increase his hit points. Just got that. Okay, cool. <clears throat> We're almost done with uh, training the militia here as well. Yeah, very soon we're going to be good. I just seem to have a knack for learning new things. What can I tell you? I'm done. Good. We do not want to train another militia because we have seven. Uh, could we land over here? Yes, we can. But it would not take us long to just do a small pause here. Right. Force move. That is finished. Modify the weapon. Leave a lot of stuff um, in here. <clears throat> so, sniper for you guys. A couple of Molotovs. Uh, I think he keeps the gas mask. Um, berry, berry, berry. We still have the G uh, G36, which is an excellent ranged weapon. And I think we could give that to the second team. It's a long range. But then again, we wanted proper a uh, proper Overwatch. Um, this here is a long-range version with high crit. Still trying to make sense out of it. This is the longest range um, assault rifle. <coughs> Lots of pipes. Uh, second team can ammo craft. Another flare gun. Tear gas, which we don't need. Lenses, which we don't need. Kettler West, potentially good for. Uh, potentially good for <clears throat> blood. This here are quest items. Might want to put them back. Another quest item. I don't know, can we repair the locksmith thing? I'm not sure. Would be cool if it would work. 
Good, but we got plenty of other stuff. Now, you guys wanted some modifications. Um, in which case, you come over here. I am finished. If you need me, I'll be oiling my chest. Good. Now, finally, modify. This should be now live wire, right? Yeah. So all of those things are becoming easy. Uh, we want quick prism scope. Yes, please. As a muscle. Uh, silent attacks are good. Crit bonus is good as well. Accuracy bonus for subsequent attacks. Question is, is he stealthy? Or do we want to hit better? I like the crit chance as well. And silent attacks have a lot of advantages in this game, like a lot of advantages, specifically if he's hidden. Uh, the compensator, on the other hand, isn't bad either. He has a lot of strength, so I think he's not the uh, he's not the silent guy. So we're using compensator. Yeah. There are not going to be any chips left over for you. They go to the prime team. Increase accuracy bonus, increase range. Uh, that is exactly what we want. Increase AP when reloading. Yes, please. Good. Looks more like an assault uh, rifle now, but it is an SMG. And it still uses 9mm? Yes. So. Looks like a well modified weapon. Um, anything else that you guys need as modification? That's a fully modified weapon. He has a fully modified weapon. You have a fully modified weapon. Um. And they can craft um, shotgun ammunition if needed. Okay, do they need anything else? I mean, hmm. We could just give him the M fourteen and uh, modify the rest. How much would that cost? It already has a bipod and everything. Uh, there is a shorter version, right? Reduces range. Not too much, still 20 range. But uh, the attack cost would go down. Hmm. I wonder... <coughs> What is his problem really? He wants to get up and personal, right? And then typically he wants to use a shotgun. So actually what he needs is a shotgun and not an M14, but we don't have one at the moment. Um, your weapon is good. You're just not hitting with it. That is a problem.
Yeah, no clue. She has a really well modified weapon. Even the UV dot on it. Yeah. Well. We achieved what we wanted to do, which was uh, modify his MP5. He can let go of the famous. Although the famous is a good weapon. We wanted submachine guns, so we're taking submachine guns. Maybe he's just going to be a mid-range skirmisher, which would be strange because steroid doesn't sound like a mid-range skirmisher, in which case mouse and blood would be the front line. <clears throat> but yeah, whatever. He can always he can always take that into the backpack for two AP and then fist slam someone into the ground, I guess. Or even drop them. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. Okay, what do we have? What else do we have? All of the other weapons look interesting as well, but I don't want to sink a lot of um, <coughs> parts into it. I think our main team has done its job. It's done its duty more than enough. That was 100 or 150 parts easily. You guys go back to here and the main team in a well-rested state realizes that in five days there's another legion attack inbound um, and in the meantime we're going to kill camp Bien Chien uh, but that will happen next episode thank you for watching guys it was a pleasure as always if you enjoyed Jake the Lions 3 Leave a comment and a like down below and see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.